For this video, I buy the rarest 262 in the game. Yes, James, that is a lot of boost. More power, baby! <clears throat> anyway, why would I buy an $80 plane off the Gaijin Marketplace for the sole purpose of this video? Well, the answer is pretty simple. It is to complete this task in the Battle Pass. For the Ballistics Calculation Challenge, we need to kill things with three different types of rockets. The medium ones was pretty easy for me, and of course, the heavy ones was too. You can't really go wrong with HVARs and RP3s, of course. But for the light rockets, that's a different story. We have to use a rocket that weighs less than 5 kilograms. For the American viewers, that's anything that weighs less than a raccoon. And lucky for me, it just so happens that my new friend, the Sturmvogel here, has tiny little rockets on its wings that are just up to the task. They weigh exactly 3 kilograms each, that's about 2 Big Macs. And of course, they have 624 grams of TNT equivalent which is perfect enough for taking out M18s and open top SPAA. The problem, however, is they're not really good at doing anything else short of hitting an aircraft with one pretty much point blank, so this will be a little bit of a challenge. Honestly, that whole spiel is just a massive cope for me, trying to justify the fact I've spent $80 on a virtual in-game item. But here we are, and we should have a lot of fun regardless. <laughs> Let's get into battle with the Bulldog, and we'll see how we get on. Right, great map for us to start with, let's go! Very first game! Let's see, we are against USA, which is always <laughs> always a good thing against M18s, and China as well, which means more M18s, more M36s, and of course the M64, which is the Bulldog with the M18 turret. Actually, I haven't played that yet, interestingly enough. We'll see what happens. Quite a small game though, it's quite early here for in the UK, Scotland specifically. Not that the time zone's any different anywhere in the UK. Come on, C. Not good. Pick me again. Pick me again. Come on. Oh, I missed his little cannon. I'm out of here, dude. You can forget it. Someone else is attacking him. Thank you very much. That is gonna definitely bring down the cost of this thing to spawn in. That was close though, right? It's the fun thing about that little Fiat. Oh, scorpion. I love it when you've got vehicles you can destroy without even firing your main gun. Right, are we going to get sniped from across the map or what? Nobody's up there yet. The, the unfortunate thing is that's two vehicles I think we could have killed. If we were using the... The Sturmvogel. Right. Here we go. Actually, do you know something? I want... Oh, that's uh, that's open top, right? So we'll do. 50 cal, let's get... Actually... If, just pick me again. I need this guy to kill me. I almost knocked this breach out. Uh, I would like to shoot this plane down with my 50 cal. But leave the plane alive so it's another victim that we can get with rockets. Because it doesn't specify kill ground units, right? It just specifies that we have to kill a vehicle. Let's try and crit this guy as he comes down. Hopefully he doesn't kill my teammate though, is the only thing. Can't actually reach him. Unless we wiggle the 50. He didn't drop, did he? No, he didn't. And he didn't go straight back vertical again. That's an M51. I can't kill that with rockets anyway, so... Oh, what a great shot it was. Well done. Right, his engine is out. Let's G out of this. Let's go take our Sturmvogel. And maybe since his engine is crit, he'll be going slow enough I can slam him. Let's go. Are people upset with the Israeli tech tree? That's pretty funny. Like it's a good tech tree. Right, he is very slow. So I think I'll chase him. We can't be full throttle either, otherwise we'll just burn up. I'm going to have a hard time hitting him with rockets though, is the only thing. Unless we wait till he's almost hitting the ground. Then hit the ground with the rockets so the fragmentation splashes up and kills him that way. Using big brains here. There goes a obel as well, we could have easily slammed. Another plane's coming in now, and I think it's a jet. Oh, I think he's just hit the ground. Looks like our first kill's gonna be an easy one. 
been good. Too bit far. Right, that should be enough to claim it. It is. Actually, there's two planes. This is bad news. I don't want to keep making my turning circle here, poor. I think that's our first rocket kill, though. Right, I'm way too fast for this to drain now. I don't know where the other plane went. Oh, he's up here. Right, I'm going to have to get some distance away. Is that what I think it is? I missed it too. It is an M18. He might get straight for this yak, though. I'm going to have to get rid of this M18 with my rockets and then try and focus my attention on the two aircraft that are below me. I think a Yag 3 is dead. This dude ain't moving, is he? Come on, rockets. Yes, that's two. Don't tell me we get this done in one video. One match, I mean. Right. We got 10 left. Do I have an assist? Yeah, I think I got an assist for the M36. I think I see an R3 T20 down there. Which is not great. This guy's chasing me up into the stratosphere, which I'm not very happy about. But it depends on... This is airfield shooting at me. I don't want that, obviously. He should catch me here. I'm going to have to turn away from him and get my speed back, which we'll easily be able to do. I'm actually not overheating like I thought I would be. Oh, the M36 was still alive, actually. Yeah, this guy can't catch me now. We are way too fast. I'm not sure what it was, but it, a prop is not doing 700 plus on the deck. The R3 does scare me. And that's a scorpion. Yes, that's good. I'm not sure if that kill counted, by the way, with the dude, uh, uh, the plane I hit, right? The plane. So I need to be really careful here. This has been very fortuitous. Okay. <laughs> it's a 2005 Italian boy. Interesting, interesting. And that's another prop going very fast. I want to kill our throttle just a tad so I can cool us down a little bit and get some space. He's chasing me around. We still have another spawn on our bulldog so I also want to win the game, right? But I could, I could actually check the challenge right now, I'm sure, but let's try and deal with the two planes we've got first. One of them is a super prop for sure, he's really fast. Unless he just dove to get speed. Japanese aircraft. And the Italian one is trying to leave. Can't have that. Six rockets. Oh, he just got set in fire. I'm not confident I'll hit this dude before we get to his airfield. And he's trying to trying to bait me for his teammate and we're not going to take it we are not going to take that I'm preserving my existence right now but he is going to land and that's okay with me that's fine bulldog and an anti -air. a Chinese one I believe. The only thing is, I don't think I can overpressure the crew in the hull. If I do manage to get a shot on him, or is it an M19? We got six rockets left. This dude is coming for me as well. Those are going to be too low. No, I got him. I got him. Okay, so that's it. We actually did it. But uh, I still got this dude on my tail. It actually did. Do you know something? I don't think bringing the rockets on the 262 is a terrible idea just in general because there's so many open top stuff 
and that's way more efficient than using your cannons trying some this guy's climbing for me then he really doesn't like me does he oh this other guy is pretty deadly cannons on that a bit if he can't catch me he can't catch me that is a hell diver and we are nose down and out of here he's trying <laughs> he's just he's just trying to keep me away from the battlefield or or it's, it's just salty, I don't know. Well, they're back on A. Maybe that R3. I got tons of fuel. Tons of it. I'm going to give this guy a little bit of an angle just so I can try and get this hell diver out. Yep, there we go. Mr. Pigeon's gone. Come here, dude. Come on, then. Right, let's see if I can beat this guy up now. What is that? A 44 or something? I can't actually tell. He'll hang pretty good is my only issue, and he's been turning pretty hard to try and get shots on me, so... We'll get some distance for sure. He's the last guy I left, right? Maybe this online guy, I'm not sure, or the Yarrick guy. Wait, over we go. I won't want to head on against them, but yeah, we will get guns on me pretty, pretty good. Oh, you've switched target. Have you switched target? Oh. Yeah. He has them, but the sticker's coming for him as well now. And back up the go. Oh, my sticker just shot me. If that sticker takes out whatever that thing is, then I'm going to laugh so hard. He's going to have to manoeuvre to avoid me, and actually, the sticker might get a shot. The sticker crashed. I got him. It's a key 84. Well, pass done. And there we go. A light rocket challenge. <laughs> Players defeated three. And uh, we got the ballistics calculation thing done in one match. Let's take this out some more and see if we can actually get that replicated in every single game we play. Right, an another 7-7 seven, seven game. I suppose the good thing about a full up here is that how much is it from our plane? 515 and it's not a lot. Basically a single kill and we're good. Damn it, dude. I thought I would get this guy on that, dude, but nope. Someone's in the water with us. I can't scout him yet. I, I actually don't even know what it is. It's another bulldog. There goes the AI plane in the background. Someone is here. Oh, that's the thickness. Thank you. Big thickness there. If we get this cap, we are playing. This uh, this enemy bulldog really wanted this cap too, right? I don't see anything else back there. Oh, he's coming out of the water up this way. Stop that. That was scary. I, I just can't see this dude and I don't think I would, oh, he's there. I wouldn't see him even if he peeked up there just because of the way the light is. Dropped his RA2 much in the middle of the cap. This other guy though, and there's another artillery dropping. Three artilleries. I guess they don't want me here, right? I don't see him. Where did you move to? Is 
a sin. Part one. Tried to go lower, but it has the dirt. Oh, the bulldog's dead. There he goes. Right, we got plenty of spawn points now. That issue hundred. Guess who's getting artillery? Do you? Is that a T-82? Sure is. And he's got a hunter killer the same as me, so... We got the, uh... We got the scout. Oh, he's... I just missed his gunner. I want him to shoot something not important on me. Ah. Uh. Can't see any of them for that orange smoke. Are oh, you going up the hill now? It's got better gun depression than me, right? Oh. I was looking at a dead panda and not at the other guy and his BMP got me. Right, we can't do anything to them top down with rockets, so... I don't know what we're going to do here. Less than... Almost 300. It's one point, it's like... Ninja Muffin. My favourite kind. Two six two just pancake that guy. Oh, let's grab a few things on that corner. Oh, you were shooting at me. Is that an artillery thing? A tank fired at me. I am not seeing any open dubs down here. None there. Here comes fifty cal. That's a BMP. That's not an open top either. I don't know why you would want to spawn an open top at this BR, so... I think we're going to be... Shoot out of luck right now. I just noticed a scorpion. He's actually done over pressure all that well. Is that a PT-7657 there, by the way? Better not be. It's just a PT. Oh, okay. That's two. And a plane coming in. Um, I'm impressed that rocket killed that guy. I think it was the fuel that caused the detonation. Just try and uh, sneak up on this aircraft. Oh, 262. That happens to the best of us. And also the worst of us, like me. We have been spotted, gentlemen and ladies. The Dornier is helping. Uh -huh. You are prime target number one down there. Kugel Blitz killed him. The Kugel, oh, Kugel Blitz is also dead. The 3D5 is gonna <laughs> ruffle stomp this M16 if he sees him. I want to make sure we get this guy right. There we go, that's three. And I fill up to you as well, but I mean, it was an M16, so... Oh, an M18! And there's an SU-100P somewhere. Where's he at? Oh, there he is. SU-100P is going first. But he sneaks around the Reichstag. I think there's another anti-air. Shinaz. I got one crew member out with that hit. It's an M16, eh, sorry, M19, or an M42. You can't aim for me for too long. 
The only thing is he's got at least some sort of armor for splash hits. Okay, I actually got him with it first of all. Let's see if we can get this M18 out. And then swing by that anti-air as well. So we're going to give this guy one or two. There he goes. And one for you. Ah, uh, just hits. But that was what? Five? Five rocket kills at 7-7 seven, seven as well. We take those. We take them. Wait, a little late to the party, but let's go. Oh, I heard shitting up here already. Yeah, a couple of guys chilling at the exit. Their spawn just got hit. I'd much rather I gain some ground here than go on a scrum right now, but I might get sniped. <laughs> Probably from the cliffs up here. Somebody's up here. Don't like that. Sounds Russian too. Shit, please don't be a PT-7657. Oh, it's Italian boy -o. Now we push him right, he's in no cannon breach. That is a very unfortunate 90 mil cannon this boy has on this. Is is he actually reversing back? I can't tell if that's two tanks or just one. He's being repaired actually. He's gonna be upset with that, right? Oh there's there's quite a few here. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. That's a lot of anger in one spot. They've all helped each other repair too. Jeez. <laughs> They're trying to find me through that gap. The good news is for me I don't fire heat, right? <laughs> I got this I got this C13 with the RA. That feels so cheesy when you get kills like that. I don't like it anyway. The other one's coming up behind me. It's a psycho. I missed his ammo. Thank you, teammate. Right, maybe I can get back round behind this guy again. There's another there's another one. I'm pretty sure I crit a medium tank. Oh no, okay. That thing just straight up ate my around his fuel tank am I scouted here or what's happening is it another RT piece thing it's scouted dude no that's the medium tank and yes it is another RT piece there's no way it's just a scorpion Goodness, dude! What a what a fight! Holy crap! There's an airplane coming now. Those ours. That was absolutely bonkers, dude. We only get we only get thirteen hundred spawn points. Well, not even a thousand spawn points for that because it didn't cost as much to spawn this. I don't see anyone cliff dwelling. Took half the enemy team out. That's a stupid hobble. Where, where are you shooting? This guy's back here shooting over this direction. Where did I get killed from? Oh, you were up on the cliff. Son of a diddly. We get, oh, actually, you're you are free uh, kills on my rockets. Let's go. 442. I thought most of the things uh scouted got killed. Maybe just one. Got three assists, but I did actually shoot some, so definitely two of them side by side right now. There's a third one. At least I got that hobble right. <laughs> the consolation prize. There's a stupid R3 down there as well. I need to remember not to go near that. 
Are you aiming at me? No. Dude, I should have aimed off a wing rather than off the middle. I just have this feeling that they're gonna have a spread, you know? Is your horizontal gone or are you just not looking up? What is happening here? Okay. I, I took his crew members out one by one and that R3 just shot me and we survived. Must be on AP bills. Oh! Another open top thing. I don't even know where the R3 is now. It's probably really close to that guy, right? Right, let's try it. Far away. The, the damage to my plane is causing problems with the uh, uh, rocket accuracy. Right, what's hiding behind here? An AMX. Uh oh. That, that is not good there. The best I can hope for right now is just a head on. Velocity is too slow on the guns. He's going very fast though. He's going to die. He pulled up in time. I'll take another head on when you do it if you want it. Okay. Right. I think I'll be able to spawn another one. So it's no big deal. I just wanted to get rid of that guy because... Very painful for our ground targets. So we have to get another three. That one didn't count. Fill up tiers are tough. Not that that thing's even a fill up tier, right? It's the SU-11 that's a really broken one. R3 just killed a Leo. Of course he did. That AMX-13 still running amok. Oh no. I think that's a BTR. And another ZSU. Oh, yeah, okay. The ZSU, the BTR, sorry, fired a short burst and has managed to kill my friendly. Does not install me with any sort of confidence whatsoever. You know where I am, right? Because you're not blind. Okay, I am willing to bet that guy's turret crew is still alive. It is. I only killed the people in the hull somehow and... I don't like the fact that he's that good of a name. But he's like doing one or two shots at a time. What's that you in fire? The thing on C? What Thunder's a horror game. There's an R3. That thing just fired up at me. Which means I know exactly where it is, right? It's a... The 2S3M. Again, another one. Oh my god, those... Okay, I got them. The fact those rounds are like completely dead silent really, really scares the bejesus out of me. R3's firing at me too. I am just going to go for this guy so I can get my third kill real quick. But the R3 is also firing at me and my plane is not behaving the way it should really. I missed him. <laughs> I missed him. No, that counts. That counts and I'm counting it. <laughs> I am the rocket. <laughs> right, back to you. You guys remember when I said in the first game that I said the rockets were viable? Well, actually, no. This thing gets two bomb drops. I took it out in a couple of games with the two 250s and then just use the cannons to the kill open tops and it turns out these 30mm are actually better than the rockets for killing open tops so we're gonna have to revisit this 262 sometime in the near future <laughs> just using the bombs it's also a strike aircraft which is ridiculous anyway if you enjoyed today's video please remember to hit the like button if you're not already subscribed make sure you subscribe too i'm gonna do a sort of irl thing this week so keep your eye out for that and i've got a huge announcement too as always i would like to thank all the supporters over on the channel that's on discord and patreon especially to all the tier threes who get a shout out that's toast mcgee gg bruh frost audible bow bofey the starry gifted greed jimmy marushin please call me landon squeezel stoyan terry bad 
and the Witch Doctor, and to the tier threes on Patreon. That's Sickness Win, Matthew S, Eric Fear, Jesse Mills, Paul Wendrick, the Taco Guy, FTN Watermelon, Shane McGuire, and the Stormwind, Brandon, aka the Flying Pickle, Ethan, Excavation Nation, Handsome Tortilla, King the Salt Lord, Coil Metany, please call me Landon, Ralph, Rage, Tactonic, Tanks Gone Well, TV2000 Atomic, Varian, Warpig, Shaf, Elysia Mortanen, Stoyan, this is totally my name, Jay Tormey, David, Pyrophoric, Shmoo, and the one the one, the only Rosalini. That's the first time I've said that correctly. Anyway, thank you guys very much for watching. Much love and bye-bye.